when you're facing a medical emergency. Time is critical. Every minute matters. And today, time is on your side because Northcrest Medical Center is ready 24-7. We have the experience and expertise to act decisively and the leading edge technology crucial for life-saving surgery, letting you get back to the life you love. Northcrest Medical Center, bringing exceptional care to our community. Uh, approximately 2.30 this afternoon, Millersville Police received a 911 call of an uh, armed robbery that took place at Authentic Coffee, uh, located here on Louisville Highway. Um, during our investigation, we discovered that two males, uh, one black male, one either Hispanic or white male, entered the store uh, wearing white uh, blue shirts over their head, held the clerk and one other person at gunpoint, robbed the store of its safe, fled on foot. Uh, we believe they left in a white uh, Volvo with some damage on the driver's side door. Uh, we were told that um, w there was one person with a gun and then another person came behind someone and put their arm around them? Um, again, we're still under investigation at this point. Uh, some information I'm getting is one of them uh, did go behind one of the employees and, and put a gun to her head. And so this is a pretty violent robbery. It was. Yes, yeah, very violent. And we don't think it's connected to the manhunt from earlier? At this time, we have no reason to believe so. Uh, at this point, all I have is uh, a black male. I believe he was wearing black shorts, uh, dark colored shirt, dark shoes, uh, with a some sort of rag or shirt tied around his head, white in color. The other individual, I'm not sure on a description. If you have any information, you're urged to call the Millersville Police Department at 615-859-2758. Yes, we've been here seven over seven years, and it's a community place. It's always been a family-friendly, you know, it's a safe place, too. But um, we were robbed today and robbed at gunpoint, and it's uh, kind of shocking, and we're going to give God the glory because uh, we're here for that reason. Nobody was injured. We are grateful for that. Uh, the young lady that was here is only 18 years old. That was kind of disturbing t for me, you know, because young, tender age, uh, you know, adults, um, still, it's, it's, it's a traumatic thing. Well, I'm sitting here in the coffee shop. Uh, I'm one of the, co one of the uh, frequent customers, and uh, two gentlemen came in the front door, and uh, I noticed that they acted very suspicious and then uh all of a sudden he come around the corner here had a pistol pointing at me he told me to get up and go down the hallway and get in one of the restrooms and uh when i walked past the coffee counter here the other gentleman had the uh, young lady from behind had his arm around her neck she was very shook up uh, first time she's ever been through anything like that in me too some, strangely, somehow, um, I, rem I remained calm. I just didn't want him to steal any credit cards in my wallet. But um, they grabbed everything they wanted and uh, left. They left, they left, rudely, they left before I even had the chance to offer them a free donut. <laughs> now, you might not want to put that in there. <laughs> <laughs> might not sound right well there you have it robertson county rick was quite a character i think the clerk in the store was probably lucky that he was there if you happen to recognize the individual in this video or this vehicle you're encouraged to call police as soon as possible the robertson county funeral home has been serving families for a quarter century when it's time to celebrate and remember to honor in loving memory the robertson county funeral home